Oh, geez, my brain's so fried <laughs> over this script and what's happened in the last three weeks. Oh. We had super complex steady cam moves with non actors who were drunk. You know what we're all trying to do today, so I will be speaking to you all individually in the back room. I thought this was the year to make it. You know, rain, hail or shine. So, just kind of went at it. I was pretty nervous coming into this because I've never done anything of this scale. Just, you know, running in the dark with scissors. Um, and if something had gone wrong, it could have really blown up. Three, two, one, light! You know, we'll get through a shoot and then we're out of money. We will be... We're already broke. Mum dressed us. Yeah. Okay. Get that fucking thing out of the way. I'm in my fucking process. I don't know, it feels great to be able to get all those ideas that have been stuck in your head out and see them manifest and see them become real and see actors say the words that you've only, you know, yeah. you've only ever kind of experienced in your in your brain. It's all pretty great. Fondest memories of a shoot I will ever have. Oh, God, honestly, and I am so proud of this crew and so proud to be part of this film. I think this experience has been, like, utterly exhausting. Like, it's, you know, it's tested kind of, I think it's tested me emotionally a lot more than I thought it would. One of the things that I knew was coming, but I didn't expect how hard it was going to be constantly. Our schedule was super tight and there was no real time to kind of gather yourself. You just had to keep rolling and keep going and keep charging. And it was really, really scary, but I kind of just thought I'd, you know, you have to jump off at one point. And I guess this is that point and hopefully it kind of leads to other films which I think will be just as nerve wracking but you know at least you know you can do it. About to wrap!